this is a brand new Schrader core that's not been installed yet. And you can see that blue ceiling surface is nice and polished on there and it's got no marks on it. When you tighten the Schrader core, this little piece actually swivels on there. So when you tighten the fitting in, what you're doing is pushing it straight into the ceiling surface. It meets with the ceiling surface and it forms a, a gasket. The gasket becomes compressed and that's a, 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 the one and done. Now, if we contrast that to a used Schrader, you can see that ring around there. You see a little ring and that's where that's seated into the valve seat. And so that is plastic deformation, permanent damage to the Schrader core on the outside. If we tried to reuse it, it might not be thick enough in areas to actually create that seal that we need so the Schrader core doesn't leak. This blue ring is our outer seal and this is our inner seal. Most Schrader cores, when they leak, actually don't leak through this end of the stem. They leak around the outside of the Schrader core. 